and tired all the time. And then they expect me to give my seat up to ladies or old people? I understand the handicap. They deserve it. But just people, just regular people, I'm supposed to give my seat up just because they're older than me? You know what? Fuck that. I sit my ass down. They can all suck my dick. I am not giving up my seat for nobody. I, I, I spend eight damn hours, eight to nine hours in school learning this shit. Don't you think I deserve a little recognition? I don't get no recognition anywhere. I don't get no recognition in school, at home. The best recognition I could get is on the train or the bus. Recognize me, but let me sit my ass down. You, when I'm standing, you don't see me asking people for a seat. No, you don't see that. I don't give nobody my seat. One time, I was sitting on the train, and then some lady, mid-30s, she wasn't even looking that old. She come to me, she she started acting like she's sick and tired. She, she put her bag down in my face, so I would notice her, so I would give my seat up. She goes, uh, my back hurts. And she starts dropping her bag, digging through her bag in the middle of the train. Talking to herself, she's rubbing her wrists, she's cracking her knuckles, like there's something wrong with her. And she looks at me between each and everything she does, she looks at me. And I look at her with this face. I'm not gonna give you my seat, son. Stand your ass up. If you don't got a cane, you don't get my seat. Alright? Fuck you. You ain't getting my seat, that's my seat. You should have got here early. You should have got on, a, uh, on an earlier stop or something. Walk your ass, cause I'm I'm not I'm not giving my, my seat. MTA can suck my dick. I'm not giving my seat for the old people. Fuck the old people. Oh, okay, you know not fuck the old people. Fuck the greedy old people. Yeah, cause what the fuck you need the seat for? This lady was getting off the next stop. What the fuck you need to sit for? And when I do want to give her my seat. They don't want to sit. Like, what the fuck? I'm trying to be generous here. And you take my generosity as a fucking joke? Fuck you. Fuck you. I don't want to give up my seat for you. And you don't want to take my damn seat. And when they do take my seat, I be getting tight. Because I be like, you know, this is a big mistake. I have like seven more stops left. But I keep the biggest smile on my face. So they don't think that I'm fucking selfish. And I fuck what they think. I ain't never giving my, my seat again. One time I tried to get my seat up to an old man. Notice that old, just men in general, have too much pride to take anything from another nigga. So I tried to give him up my seat. And this guy spazzed. Like, he thinks he's so young that he doesn't deserve a seat. Like, I'm giving you my seat because you look like you're 50 something. You're not 20. Stop, nigga. I, I say, yo, sir. Do you, I said, sir. Do you can do you mind sitting? Uh, do, would you like my seat? He says, no. I still have my youth. I can walk up and down these stairs. There's nothing wrong with me. And I, I I'm like, yo. I didn't ask you all that. I asked you, do you want a seat? And then the guy goes, I don't want your damn seat. I'm young enough. I can stand. I can hold this pole. I can lean on the door. I can do it. I don't need your seat. And I'm like, okay. I, I just assumed that you was old and shivery since you have the Kings County Hospital band on your arm, glycerol medication in your left pocket, you got a cane, you crunch in your back, you got like three hairs on your head, 75 hairs between your noses, and you ashy as a motherfucker. I, I just assumed you was rather homeless or old. I'm like, huh? Don't take it as a big deal. The thing is, I am never giving up my seat again. I will be everybody with an elder who doesn't have a car. Go show them, tell them to look at this video. Because I ain't never giving up my seat again. If you see me, if you see me, just know I am never giving up my seat. Alright? I ain't giving up my seat to bitches. I ain't giving up my seat to niggas. I ain't giving my seat to old niggas and old bitches. Alright? Point blank. I ain't giving up my seat. That's it. My seat does not need my boot out. It is my seat. Fuck you. I sat down. And I hate when old people want my seat when there's like three other open seats everywhere. Like, bitch, 
I don't care if you want to squeeze into the corner at the back of the bus. I am not giving up my seat. I sit here for a reason. I want to get easy access at the door. Leave my seat alone. It is my seat. <laughs> Beat, son. Damn. This is my seat. No one touch my seat. I don't want to sit down. You can dip. This is my seat. Alright? Nobody's getting my seat. Fuck y'all. I ain't getting nothing. None. I don't care if the front of the bus got caught on fire and on the back of the bus. I'm going to wait till the bus, till the fire reaches almost to the back door. Then I will get up. Because I ain't giving up my seat for nobody. I ain't giving up my seat for the fire. It is my seat. Fuck you. Alright? My seat. just don't like giving up my seat. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I love you niggas. I, lo I love my fans. I love ya. I love ya. Mwah. I love ya. Okay? Keep watching my videos and whatnot. Keep up with me at Applaud Me. That's my Twitter name. You can on my Twitter, I don't know what they say, right here, laugh me up, Martel laughs Alexis, that's pretty much it, I love you, alright?